Meanwhile, the Greenfield Police Department looking to spend a quarter million dollars to revamp the force's radios. 24 Hour News 8's Eric Feldman joins us after spending the afternoon in Greenfield, learning why the police chief says this upgrade is really vital to officer safety, Eric. Yeah, Brooke, it sure sounds like a lot of money, but Chief Jeff Rash says this is actually a pretty standard cost, about $4,000 per radio. To make it more economical, though, they want to spend that 250 k over three years, and the police chief tells me after more than a decade of having the same radios, it's time for an upgrade before they stop working. In an age when police technology is evolving and modernizing, it's the radio. We take this piece of equipment for granted sometimes. Leading the way. We have a trouble with a person at the speedway. For officer communication. This is his lifeline to his help. From a domestic violence call to checking a burglary alarm to a simple traffic stop, that radio is on the police belt just in case. The only way that they can call and ask for help if they need help. And so, you know, we want to make sure that they've got good, reliable equipment. And for the last 14 years, Greenfield PD has had the same radios. They're so old that Motorola no longer makes some of the parts if one breaks. They're just wearing out. So Chief Jeff Rash says they're looking to replace those radios with newer models before one stop working in the field and put lives in danger. I just want to make sure when an officer walks out the back door of this police department and gets in their car to go serve the community, they got the best equipment that they can. So this radio purchase was on first read at the city council in Greenfield this week, and it could be voted on in the middle of June. This money comes from a county tax fund that is specifically earmarked for law enforcement improvements. I'm Eric Feldman, 24-Hour News 8.